What's up guys, Legion here from Dell Does, and welcome back to another episode of Shattered Skies, and uh, this time I just received uh, moments ago my first death uh, by a group of three guys when I was roaming solo, and I looked up in the top right hand corner of my screen, and what do you know, I did not have it recording. Very upsetting, um, I have no gear left anymore, and I was quite geared that I thought personally last time but for the most part of it the beautiful thing about it was I hadn't actually opened up any of the things that I got with the ultimate pack guys I hadn't opened up any of them so for the purposes of this video today I thought why don't we go through these crates and see what we get out of it I mean let's do an unboxing let's experience this together the all of these um you know like uh, attachment boxes, uh, different different levels of attachment boxes here. Oh, we've got an error there. Uh, failed to perform inventory operation. Oh, okay. Uh, very interesting. Maybe it's because they need to go um, into that bar. Uh, oh, okay. Very unusual. Let's put all the material stuff up here for now. And, um, I mean, look, you, the ultimate pack comes with so many... Uh, oh look, we're already too heavy, so maybe I should put a backpack on. I bet you I don't even have a backpack saved in here. Oh bugger, I don't even have any backpacks, sorry guys. But um, you know, let's let's do it. Let's go through it. Let's experience what this is, um, you know, together, and uh, we'll see what we come up with. So we'll open the cosmetic box, an M9 digital. Okay, so what's so how does this work? So, um, this item does not drop on death. Open this gift box to receive a permanent headwear cosmetic item for your character. All right. Very unusual. Uh, you unlocked a special item. You received a, a, a M9 digital. Apply cosmetics to your character via the customization menu. Oh, cool. All right. So that's like a customization thing for um, my uh, M9, basically. I would I would assume. Basics gun skins. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, Wolf Wolfstorm Snowblind. Okay, cool. It's, it comes in the form of a spray can. That's pretty interesting. You've uh, unlocked a special item. You receive a new permanent weapon paint. Cool. All right. So, I'm um, I'm a little uh, a little scared of Bizon Ghost. I'm a little scared of what it, when it's talking about permanent ARS Emperor. Cool guys. So we're not having any double ups just yet. You know, talking about permanent stuff. Is that does that mean that there can be things that aren't permanent? Cool compensators. Okay, so this is going to be an attachment box. So these are the types of things that I do need to put back into my stash um, because basically I can lose all of these um, if I get killed, as I just experienced this before. Uh, you know, uh, and I will admit that I should have been a little bit more aggressive when I was fighting that last battle. Um, basically, they sent one guy out uh, to come and look for me, and I was in a bush, and I could have killed him. I could have killed... Oh, watch out, guys. Shit. What we did last time, remember? Remember what we did last time? We dropped stuff on the ground. Let's be careful of that. I don't have a backpack. Let's be very careful of that and put all this away. Cool. So we've got a whole bunch of attachments there. Oh, my God. Yes, guys. Hollow sight. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. I can't wait to crack that out. Um, uh, let's, let's see. We've got a few more boxes here. Oh, damn. Look at this. Freaking 10 box. A 10 box of attachments. Will it move? Ah, failed to perform. Okay, that's very unusual. Uh, will it move there? Maybe I can only move like five at a time or something. Maybe that's the problem. Seems to be some issues um, with what you can move and what you can't move. Oh, you, I am blown or too heavy. It's, it's quite funny. I, I enjoy that actually. You know, so it's in a sense you can't be overburdened with a whole bunch of stuff. Um, but it's quite funny, guys. Uh, you know, really, the this is probably one of the the biggest amount of stuff I have ever gotten um, in in like the the top tier kind of pack that you can get with games. Uh, a sweet suppressor. Uh, obviously, by the looks of that health bar, it doesn't last forever, which I enjoy, guys. As long as it's not. Hardcore to the... Oh my god, a hundred round magazine? A hundred round drum magazine? Holy crap! For the 5.56? Five, five, long sight? Long range? Oh, I, got, I gotta check this. I can't get over this. Really? This is not... This can't be real. This cannot be real. Let's have a look. Let's see what it is, alright? Let's see which gun. Alright, well, I'm too heavy at the moment, so I can only do one. 
Okay? Let's have a look at this. If I can put... Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> Guys! Oh my god! Oh my god, a hundred round drum magazine! I could just, just be sitting there with the AK just like... Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. Oh man. Oh man, take that attachment off. Take that attachment off. Take that attachment off right now. Oh dude, that is... Uh, you know what? I cannot wait um, to go through gearing up some of my guns later on now once I've gotten through all of this. This is cool, man. And like I was saying, you know, it's got to be one of... I mean, look at all of those. They just give you a huge amount of resources. Massive amount of resources. Uh, it's probably because I'm too full. Uh, oh, one thing I did want to check, guys, is those other resources that I have, those crafting mats, did they drop when I... Um, died? I don't think they did. I think they're still there. Um, I mean, I've probably collected around that many boxes, uh, and I don't remember collecting anything else. So, yeah. Oh. Look, it must stay there. Cool, let's continue the unbox. I wish you could, like, open all. Slasher. So some of these things, obviously, um, I am going to need to get a corresponding ski mask, corresponding, like, piece of, uh, uh, armor to wear, in order to, obviously, um... I wish I'd give you a preview, you know, like when you unwrap it. That'd be cool. That'd be cool. But at least all of it is is permanent. That's another good thing that I'm enjoying as well. Um, which, although that doesn't say permanent in the description there. So, um, then again, I had the mask before, and I actually didn't need to have the mask as a piece of equipment. So once we've done this, guys, let's run through and see what we've actually picked up. Yellow tech. Awesome. Uh, that's going to look pretty sweet. Um, I'm going to imagine those are kind of like uh, maybe digital kind of camo, um, red tech, or, you know, and maybe it's designed not to uh, give me heaps of double ups, but I'm, at least I'm going to have a huge amount of customization available to me. And if it's one thing that I'm a sucker for, guys, it's customization. And you know what? On top of that, I'm a sucker for, for extras. I'm a sucker for all the extra stuff you can get in collector's editions or, um, uh, you know, like uh, early access, pre-order, all that kind of stuff. So for me to be able to have that many boxes to... Oh, what's this say? You all, oh, our first double up, guys. Our first double up. So we've got a cosmetic double up here, Red Tech. And it says, try trading this with other players to get the skins you want. Now that is cool. That is awesome. Considering how many things I have to open here. Oh, oh shit, shit, shit. You see him? He looked at it straight away. Did you see that punk? He looked at it straight away. He looked at it straight. Hey man, where's the best place for me to grind my level? Like you're level 37. How long did that take? Maybe my in-game mic isn't working, guys. Hey dude. Oh, did you see me? I just jumped forward then. Random. Random. Where's the best place to ground levels, man? Um, cool. So this red tech, we, we've got to put that back in there uh, because I need to use that uh, to trade later on, guys. Basic gun skins. Gun skins, yes. We want... Oh, shit. Where did that go? Where did that go? I get so nervous, man. You know, ever since I was just pumping out stuff before and it, like, just dropped on the ground, I get hell worried. Hell worried. Okay, cool. Let's uh, let's go and have, open the clown mask. Unwrap. Awesome. Shoes. Shoes to unwrap. Awesome. No double up. Um, I mean, uh, out of all of the things that I've opened... Oh, that's a, that's a double up, I think. That's a double up. No, unlocked another... Oh, wow. Okay, so, so far... Yeah, well, we could have a double up with these, these cosmetic boxes here, maybe. Um, at this stage, though, we are literally only dealing with one... Um, one double up. Oh yes, there we are. Yellow text a double up. So let's just put that down there and out of the way, so we don't um, know to. Oh well, you know what am I even saying? It disappears. It disappears, guys. So what, what? What? What's this craziness? Why didn't you pick me up on this weird stuff? 
and be like, Dell, um, I'm pretty sure you don't need to worry about your inventory management because I'm quite confident that once you have as selected the freaking item, it just disappears. You know, and the probably, probably the thing that I'll do, guys, is... Um, you, you, I might just you give this stuff to my buddies that I play with, or I don't know, you know. Or hit me up in the comments if you're playing this game um, and you want to like trade even. If you see something that you like, then maybe that's a way to do it as well. Oh my god, cool. It's got like a friggin' um, different color. Medium range as well. Suppressor. That's a, that's a light elite suppressor. I wonder what the uh, difference there is. So all of those things are um, basically collectibles. This guy's not, I mean, no one talks on this game, man. On this server that I'm playing on. Um, so, uh, oh, look, we got a quite a number of, uh, we're getting, now we're getting there, guys. We're getting there because we're opening so many crates. We're actually getting to the point where we are getting the double ups now. Um, oh, my God, attachment box 20? You serious? Is that going to come across? Holy crap. Then again, it's not really that exciting. Because you, you only need to get shot by one dude, and then that's... Oh, look at the flashlight on that thing. Damn. Extended mag? I got the uh, I got some extended mags um, previously and some looting that I did uh, before I got killed as well. So uh, the extended mag is always a good thing to have. I mean, a number of those is probably... Oh, laser rail. I wonder if that does a bonus to any type of... Um, let's have a look. No, t t you know, look, these things are probably just all literally cosmetic, guys, uh, by the looks of it. So, um, let's put them here. I, again, I just want to be careful, because I dropped a whole bunch of stuff on the ground before, and, you know, I'm not happy about that. Uh, basically giving stuff away for free, and some dude was standing there looting it all, you know, um, so... Uh, that's my bad though for not thinking of course. I mean where else is it gonna go? It's not gonna tell oh look we're probably doing it. We nearly did it. Oh, I am so bad. I am so bad for that. We nearly did it again guys. We nearly did it again. It would be good if you could open these crates though from uh, Within this area that would be pretty sweet Okay, well uh, 15 load. Uh, let's get some more crates in here. Let's get some more crates going uh, another cosmetic box What's it gonna take us to? No, can't do that one. It's too big. Oh, can't do that one either. Um, oh, now they're disappearing on me. Oh, can't do any of them. Okay, well, so let's just uh, open all these ones first, and then we'll go and move on to the next thing. So I think I've now seen the limit of all of the current available items um, that are here. So what I'm, you know, what I'm going to shoot myself over though is if uh, these crate things will correspond to the DLC in the future, and I could open them up and get other items because that would be really, 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 really annoying. But again, I mean, show me a game that has actually given you this much stuff from the top tier pack. Because I don't think I've ever played one that's given me this much stuff from the top tier. That's going to be up. That's going to be a double up, obviously, because uh, I had two of them. And uh, you know, so like, I just was absolutely blown away by the fact. Let's just test it, just in case. Yeah. So when I opened the uh, the crates for the first time, I was like, "What? I don't even remember reading about all of that stuff." So, I mean, just the fact that there is so many things is means that I can truly customize my character. And the beautiful thing about that is. It's not dependent on the gear that I pick up out in the world. It's just something that I can do straight up. Uh, so it gives me a really good opportunity to kind of stand out from the rest of the crowd, uh, which I really enjoy. I'm getting an error on some of these boxes, guys. I'm getting an error on some of these boxes. And, you know, it, 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 it saddens me a little bit. But let's just get these big ones out of the way because these things take forever to open. And then once we get through this, we can start going back and having a look at all the juicy goodness that we have uh, with regards to these fucking fat loots, guys. These are the fat loots. Yes, that's right. I love the fat loots. And, I mean, right now, again, we're getting double ups. But, you know, as it said before, it kind of gives me an opportunity to trade. And if there is uh, people who are willing to trade, I'll be well impressed. Uh, because you don't normally, although having said that, literally every single player I've come across, hit, hit man, snapback, what the hell, awesome. 
every single player I've come across so far, which is a total of um, uh, five. So two dudes chasing me before, and then the three man before that killed me. Um, oh, what's that? A red one. Wonder if that's any different. Uh, have all literally killed on sight. It's all been KOS. Not one of them. Oh, oh, sorry. Actually, only one dude. That level 15 dude that we came up to. Um, and he invited me to the party. And then I got nervous and bailed because I didn't trust him. Um, basically, he's the only dude that hasn't killed me straight away. But then again, he had no gear on him anyway. So he probably wouldn't have been able to kill me straight away. Uh, so yeah, we all, as expected, I mean, let's be honest guys, you know, of course we're going to get double ups, alright? There is so many things to unwrap, it would be ridiculous not to have double ups. But, you know, for the most part, considering what it might be running on, I don't know whether it's um, RNG or, or, or what it actually is. You know, we are, we are not doing too bad in, in the whole grand scheme of things, considering the amount of cosmetics that we are unwrapping. I mean, we are literally unwrapping probably a good 100 cosmetics. And I don't know where I'm up to, so I'm just going to have to do this thing and you guys be like, Oh, Dell, you know, uh, your video was good to the point where uh, basically I just got to this one section and you kept on clicking, re-clicking and clicking and re-clicking. And it got really frustrating because, um, you know, I could tell... Is that, is that one of the guys that killed me? No. Uh, you know, I got to find the guys that killed me, and I tried. I did. I did gear up. I did gear up, and I tried to go back, and I and I hunted them down. They didn't know that I was behind them. But what I did is I waited too long because they were stashing gear right in one of those open PvP areas. What I should have done while they were doing that, and they had their man on the outside, is I should have just gone straight in. I should have just gone straight in and just started killing him and if I had have killed him it would have caused like um, you know uneasiness and it would have split them up so rather than 3v1 it would have been 2v1 but I would have had one of their men down and they wouldn't have known how many of us there was so then what I could have done is maybe um, because you don't see anyone's name pop up by the looks of it when they speak right so then what I could have done is maybe spoke over the comms and put on a couple of different voices uh, and they were speaking Indonesian or um, uh, Korean or, or something. I'm not sure exactly what they were speaking, so it, it's not a, la a language that I could understand. Uh, but Leatherface, I wonder what that is. It's probably some gimp mask, I bet you. So, you know, they were able to coordinate tactics, and I wasn't able to listen to which way they were going. And they, they cornered me at a building. Um, interesting, though, that they knew the exact building that I was in um, when I would ran around the corner and down an alley. Very interesting, uh, but look, I, I'm I'm always suspicious uh, of anyone in these games because these games are normally pretty rife with uh, with people who hack, and and that is unfortunate. Not that I'm saying that they were hacking. I'm pretty sure I was the killed uh, fair and square, but you know, look, it does happen, and these games are quite easy to target because although they claim to have great uh, anti hacking uh, capabilities you know I don't see it I don't see it unless you, you're running something really really good and you're up to date with it continuously um, you know it, it, it can always be bypassed and how oh this is a blue one guys I wonder if the blue one is the um, is like the uh, super rare stuff for the AAR what you can get an AAR all right I know you're gonna do this again no uh, Dale you have you've already clicked all these things yeah I know I know I have all right, cool. Let's get these back in the box. I mean, but how intense is this, guys? We've been doing this for nearly 20 minutes. We have been unwrapping these boxes for nearly 20 minutes. That is how much stuff you get on the Ultimate Pack when you freaking purchase this game. I mean, look, if I didn't have the uh, the weight limit of 10,000 and the, and the 1,000 slots, I wouldn't even be able to remotely have any of this stuff in here. Um, and, I mean, I'm, I'm grateful that they've given you that. Again, it's... It's, well, I don't think that's going to fit. Oh, it, it, it connected. Cool. You know what they need, though? They need some, they seriously need some sorting buttons um, in this, uh, in all of your areas, in your bag and everything. They need some sorting buttons. Because it's, oh, so, what I'm seeing here is not only am I going to have skins for my character, guys, but I'm going to have skins for my weapons. And I wonder if they, um, hmm, 
Yeah. Imagine that. Imagine if you applied the skin, right? And then um, when you dropped your weapon, that was it. It was gone. Game over. No love left. So it looks like that you got a long range. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. I've seen that. What is the M4S site? I wonder if that's like a, uh, a site that lets me look through walls or something. That'd be pretty sweet. Imagine that. Oh, that guy's got a huge backpack. Let's let's click on this MS uh, M4S site and see what it, uh, M most assault rifles and submachine guns. Uh, okay, so it's just we'll check it out later. You know, we'll check that out later when once we get um, like geared up again. And I'm I'm gonna go for a, I'm gonna go for a naked hunt I think and regear myself. And I oh red dot HG. So there are a couple of things I have found. Those drums must be rare. I've only got uh, two of those at the moment. So I don't really want to... Uh, oh, another one. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. I don't really want to... I like the auto stacking on the drums, but I mean, how come nothing else stacks? Um, see? Nothing else stacks. Weird. I wonder if you can make it stack. Nope. They're actually their own individual tiles. Now we've got a random guy deciding that he's best positioned on that player's head, which is interesting. Um, so we might later just do a naked run, I think, and go and collect some more loot. And what I need to put in my stash is, um, basically, uh, I need a huge amount. Let's just do 10. I need more backpacks, more backpacks to gear up with. That's what I need because, um, I had a whole bunch of stuff and, you know, it's open loot PVP, which I love. Uh, same as another game that I'm playing, Albion, but um, the test at the moment I can't record on that test, so we'll have to wait until next month when, of course, the NDA is lifted and it goes into a um, another beta. So we'll do some filming on that. Albion Online it's quite a sweet game as well. If anyone's interested, where did that go? Oh, of course, into the box. That's there. Ah, uh, see, this is this guy just standing here, like, waiting for me to drop loot on the ground, thinking that that's what people will do all the time? I mean, why not? I guess it's a viable thing to do. I did do it uh, pretty uh, easily before. Uh, yeah, alright, let's have a look. This might be the end, guys. This is what we might, we're coming up to the end here. No more crates in my area there, so... This is exciting, man. I mean... That is a huge amount of uh, items. Having said that, though, full loot PvP, uh, you know, obviously, you're going to lose items. You're going to lose items. Although, I don't know why they just didn't chill. Oh, ACOG site, man. That's one of my favorite. I don't know why they just didn't chill. What? By the way, Delusion, go to, uh, uh, hey dude. Huh. Thanks, man. It really is awesome. So he's just said go to excavation sites. So we need to get ourselves to excavation sites. And I'm a little worried now that I might just roll, you know, fairly casually. Laser guard, I think I've got one of those before. I do have a lot of extended mags though, which is great. 
because then I can pump more bullets into the face of those punks that shot me. That's it, guys. We are... Uh, success See, how come that stacks? And yet the other ones don't. It's, it's unusual. Um, we have successfully opened up all of the loot crates that you get with the Ultimate Edition. And we have unlocked all of the cosmetics that you get with the Ultimate Edition. And it has filled me up. 86 of my slots. Mind you, I've got some ammunition and stuff in there. Uh, I've got a whole bunch of attachments um, that I can use, which is absolutely fantastic. And um, let's just pull out a couple of guns right now and see what skins we got. So I've got a, I've got a few weapons here that we can go through. Um, probably going to reach my weight limit soon. Um, but that's all of the unique weapons and a shotgun. Oh, there we go. Um. Cool, let's check out these skins, guys. Let's check out these skins. Alright, so first we're going to be taking a look at the MS4. The MS4. And I don't have any skins. I don't have any skins. I don't have any skins for the MS4. Um, well, of course I don't have any attachments, because I don't have any um, attachments in... Oh my god, you can secondary... You don't need to secondary a sidearm. Oh, I didn't even realise that. That is so cool. That is so cool. Oh, the Bison is a second... Is a, is a little minigun. Oh... Ah, or go uh, to reactor level 11. Ah, okay. Sites. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I get him. Ah, oh, cool. All right, let's see. Do I have any skins for this one? No, no skins for that one either. Interesting. I thought I collected some skins, guys. I have no skins for the Wolfstrom. Very, very, very unusual stuff taking place here. Uh, surely I have skins for this. No. Nope. What about skins for this gun? No. All right. Um, I'm pretty sure I picked up gun skins. But it does not look like that is the case, uh, ladies and gentlemen. It doesn't look like that's the case. So we will have to investigate this further because I thought that there was skins. Let's go into customize though. Maybe it's in here. No, it's not. No, it's not. Okay, well, alright. Hmm. Weapon skins? Not working? Anyway. That's enough of that. Let's have a look at what we got customization wise. Cool. So, hairstyles, they are all looking the same. Um, that just looks like it's the, the amount of stuff you get. The face, that's just what you get. What have we unlocked with the masks? Alright, so we've got Black Knight goggles. Okay, they look pretty cool. So this is a common face wear item, cosmetic box number four. Supply. Okay, sweet. So, so we've got the Black Knight goggles, they look pretty sweet there. We've got a clown mask. That looks awesome. This is a rare face wear cosmetic which can be obtained by opening cosmetic box five. Cosmetic boxes can be D Dominion Reactor Reward Bags. Oh, that's the Reactor Reward Bags. Um, so that's a rare one. So we've got one... So we've got two clown masks. Um, that's a common clown mask. That's a rare one. So that's cool. So that's cool. So we've got one of the rare ones. We've got two rare face masks. Sweet, look at that. Oh, that one would be sick. And that one. Uh, oh, that's a legendary. Wow, that's a legendary. That's a legend. Oh my god, what the hell is that? What the hell is that? Oh, is this is this legendary? No, it's rare. Leather face is rare. Oh, we got a legendary, guys. We got a legendary. Cool, man. Uh, not as bit, not as good as that one, but that's cool. Legendary. We got skull. Skull one. We got skull two. We got skull 
Uh, that looks weird with the hair. We've got a clean slasher. It's common. We've got rare. We've got rares. We've got a blue terror. I mean, look at all of these op these different options. So, like, I mean, this is just massive. The amount of cosmetics. We are only in masks at the moment. The amount of cosmetics that I have just gotten um, from that box is is so. Oh, are they legendary sunnies now? It's so cool. I mean, and then of course I got the Dominion um, commandos. The warlord. I thought the. Uh, I thought the um, the warlord set came with it, but maybe it was something else. Anyway, let's check out the hats. So we've unlocked desert tech. Uh, oh, the mask is staying on. Let's get rid of the mask. Um, uh, we've got forest. Ah, okay. So they weren't gun skins. They were actual helmets. Um, maybe you don't get any weapon skins. So maybe there's no weapon skins. So uh, doesn't work on cog or level one guns or leggies. Ah, cool. Is this is this the punk? No, there's the boss man. Oh, he's dropping shit. He's dropping level two. No, none of those guys. None of those guys killed me. Okay. Wait. I have to go hunting for some better guns, guys. So that's good to know. So your um, uh, skins will not work on uh, level one or uh, COG guns. So there must be their, their individual rare drops. So we've nearly completed it. All we don't have is night tech, which is the legendary, uh, blue tech, and uh, digital tech. I thought I uh, saw a digital tech. Anyway, uh, yeah, I think there was one. I'll have to have a look in my inventory. We've got all of the uh, M. We got all the M9 hats. Guys, we've got all them. We've got all the old military hats there, the old tin cans. That's pretty sweet. Oh, yeah! Yeah! <laughs> oh, you can handle my style. Aviators. Yeah. <laughs> and the freaking wing helmet, man. That's so cool. That's all. Oh, what are you dropping this round here? So that's Cog Hunter. We don't care about that. Um, oh, that is awesome. That is that is awesome. I love that. I, I, I just don't have the black one. Uh, we got some beanies. Some beanies? Yeah, that's cool. And I'm doing a little bit of a... We got the pom-pom beanies. Oh, that one's pretty sweet. I like that one. Uh, we got some hats as well. And then, then we got the Dominion stuff back down here as well, which is pretty sweet. Um, wow, man. So much stuff. Let's get into jackets. I didn't unlock any jackets. Oh, I didn't unlock any jackets. Okay. Um, common. Apparently that's a rare one. Uh, that's rare. Uh, that's Ultimate Edition. Or, uh, Platinum or Ultimate Edition. That's uh, Warlord set. Uh, 1000 PK rating. Uh, Ultimate Edition. Uh, default outfit. Common. Um, common. Rare. Rare. Uh, let's rock this jacket. That jacket looks pretty sweet. Let's get onto pants. Yeah, that jacket looks sweet. Don't you reckon? Yeah, that looks cool. Let's get on to pants, guys. Oh, no. I didn't get all the pants, man. I didn't get the rare pants. Oh. I got gypped on the pants. The default pants aren't actually too bad. I got gypped on the pants, guys. Look at... Oh, man. Oh, no. You know, I'm going to have to uh, unlock more stuff. Although, those pants look good anyway. This is, that, that outfit looks pretty sweet. Though. And let's go and check out the shoes. We've got a oh, massive range of shoes, but I got gypped on them. I got gypped on the boot. Legendary boots. What's that? What's that? Sweet. So they're the boots that come with the Ultimate Edition. We've got the ledge boots. Yeah. What are they? They're Platinum Edition. What are these ones? That's common. Common. Oh, so the different shadings. Oh, let's crack out the red sneakers. Yeah. Sweet. All right. Cool. Oh, he's dropping stuff on the ground. AK-12S Cog. Ninja. Oh. Of course I will. Oh, no. Let's rock out with my... um. I've got an AK-12S uh, Cog level 5 here anyway. So uh, that's probably what I'm going to be rocking out with. So we'll rock out. Let's re-gear the best we can, dudes. And um, so it doesn't look like I can do that. 
can't do that, but I could put the old, uh, the old, um, the old bison in there. So there we go, the old bison. What ammo does he need? He needs nine millimeter bullets. And then this one's running with the five five six. So I, I think you know you take a combination of uh, standard bullets and and um, uh, armor piercing because uh, you want armor. I mean, it's, it's a free level two player. Oh, Ninja, of course I'm going to take that. Why would I not? Um, uh, and I wonder if it's worth unlocking all of this stuff right now. I'm a bit nervous. I'll wait until I get killed again, I think. Um, does this one have better damage? Damage ratio. We might take out the old Wolfstrom, guys, I think. I think we'll take out the old Wolf. The old Wolf level 5 for a spin. And, um, yeah, we'll take a trap as well. We'll take a trap for when someone's trying to gank me. I can put a trap in the, in a room or something like that. That'll be good. That'll be sweet. And that's, uh, you know, oh my god, I'm going to be able to, uh, I'm going to be able to, oh, I know he said COGs. COG level guns. Um... And the other level... Oh, so I need to find some other level guns that aren't COGs. Bugger. Otherwise we would be able to... Skin it! Well, there we have it, guys. Dell does the Ultimate Edition unboxing. And there is heaps of stuff for you to collect. Uh, very happy with that. Very impressed with uh, what you get for your bang for your buck. These pants actually make my ass look kind of big, don't they? Yeah, yeah. We need to change the jacket. We need to change the jacket. I think. Um, nah. Yeah, that jacket looks pretty cool. Let's. That, that, you got. We got some pants that kind of match it. We got some pants that kind of match it. Oh, they're just so shiny. You know, they're just so shiny. Those pants. Maybe we just go the default pants. No, I wish I had them, man, or them. Well, these ones will do. These ones will do. They'll be alright. And let's have a look. What, what are we going to mask it up with? Of course, we're going to go rare clown mask. Um, what are we hatting? What hat are we using with the clown, guys? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That is hilarious. I'm doing it. <laughs> oh, that's too good. That's too good. That is great. Iron muzzle. Iron muzzle. Oh, what? It's even got the thing on the back. Um... Leather. <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh. So there we go, guys. Dell does um, Shattered Skies Ultimate Edition unwrapping. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, and if you are playing this game, drop a comment down below. And if our time zone is up, let's get together and go for a bit of an adventure. Okay, guys. You take care. What the hell? Oh my god.